We're not going to make this a thing, are we? Oh, hi. How are you doing? <laughs> Fancy seeing you here. Yeah, it's it's so it's so good to see you here. How, how have you been? How you doing? Great, great. And you, Flav? I'm... Oh, my God. I'm doing fantastic. I am so excited to be on duty because I get, be. I get to see you as well. And honestly, mm -hmm. between you and I, I only got on duty to see you today. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm just going to take a little rest uh, here on the roof. That's because it's a beautiful evening, a warm breeze, and I just love uh, looking out over this beautiful park. You know what? That's great. I'm going to I'm gonna look at the same yeah. view. Except, it's gorgeous. Yeah. I, I'll just, I'll stand here silently. And, and, oh, I love it. And watch. Yeah, I will too. Okay. <laughs> I need a second. Hold on. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, good morning, everybody. How we doing today? Happy Easter. Happy day. We shove uh, chocolate shaped rabbits in our butt or whatever people do on Easter. I, I, I don't know. Um, I made it though. Hey, what's up? What's good? I'm fucking cooked. Boy, I got a, I got, I got, I got stories from today. My God, how's everyone doing? I hope we're doing well. I hope we're doing good. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Uh, what, what's a good song to play? This is a good one. This is a good one. I, I was about to say no. Damn it! Why do we keep meeting like this? A bombastic, why? Why do you do this to me? Why do you, why do you, why do you do this to me? <laughs> why the fuck, why? We, we are, <laughs> I, this is like, this is gonna be the new daily occurrence. Hi everyone, hello, welcome. Thank you for the giant raid, by the way. I appreciate it. It is fate. You know what? I'm okay with this. This is a bit that I'm okay with for the foreseeable. Every day we could just do this. This is good. Welcome everyone. I'm Chris. I play flop. Hey, what's good? How you doing? Also, Amp coming in with a tier one. Thank you. Appreciate you. How you doing? Um, Babastic, I hope your stream was amazing as always. <laughs> I want you to know both times I've done this where you've approached i've had my intro screen up and i'm like silently getting all my my stuff ready for stream and you just slowly like make your way up 
gracefully in the background and just casually walk up every time and it's the sweetest nicest thing and then you leave for cigarettes every time <laughs> it's like oh my god i haven't seen you in years where have you been and then they just they, they leave for cigarettes every time last time it was cigarettes this time it was milk or maybe this time it was to go find the easter bunny who the hell knows um but no i hope you're all having an amazing day and doing well and doing good and you know just just doing great welcome i don't know why i did that but welcome what's good uh our favorite ass chief this is true listen out of all the ass chiefs that we have in the pd ruby is my favorite how you feeling today uh my foot's killing me uh i didn't bring my boot with me because i cannot drive with it and i was doing too much walking around uh i'm i'm hurting today but it, i'm i'm good i'll be all right i'm gonna take my, my my meds and uh go from there but ricky with the 46 months thank you so much i appreciate it and then right following through uh is amp coming in with the gifted sub the bombastic welcome thank you amp i appreciate you thank you thank you y'all are amazing you guys are way too sweet thank you thank you oh my god my fries they're about to go bad if these fries were actually good, they would know that they need to take after... Senior Buns needs to take after McDonald's. They need to create a French fry that does not go bad for the foreseeable future. We, we, need, we need fries that will outlive apocalypse. <clears throat> uh, and our, 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 our E. Cola lights going bad too. Oh, God. Oh, man. Hey, what's up, Claire? How you doing? Hope you're doing great today. But McDonald's fries go bad after like four minutes. Let's be honest. McDonald's fries are not good. In fact, I'd go on a limb and say most fast food fries, not that great. I hey, flop. Hey, Cap, how you doing? Doing great. Good to see you again. Good to see you too. They're all kind of trash. I'll be honest. The only ones that come to mind for me are like Arby's because they're kind of weird looking and chick-fil-a because they do something weird and different and then everyone else is like trying to compete for like the the fry game but i think the hot take of the century is that they, they all kind of suck <laughs> the only good thing at arby's they're fries who would have thought uh all right let's find a vehicle that isn't destroyed 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 not destroyed but it's a v-star uh every fucking car is out i <laughs> okay okay great love that wow uh best fries are costco concession no contest i don't think i've ever had costco fries who is this is this pin zone please tell me is this pin zone that was brian uh who am I going to hold up hostage for a ride? KFC wedges need need a, a, a comeback. Okay, th th this is this is definitely a hot take. KFC just needs a comeback in general. The fuck happened to goddamn KFC, man? It's not as bad as I remembered it. But man, last time I had KFC, I was very disappointed. I have heard that the new cookies from uh, Costco are apparently pretty good. Hold on. <clears throat> Flop to going. I have a big cock. Remember that time we were in a traffic stop and I whipped mine out? <laughs> yeah, but mine was bigger. Was it? Because I, I, I remember you distinctly saying, I can't handle that, and you drove away. <laughs> <laughs> um, I handle hard to... That's bad phrasing. I handle... Heart, uh, well, I, I can't use that anymore. I, I, I handle difficult things with ease. <laughs> okay. So you've trained yourself up to it. I have. Proud of you. I know. How's your day going? You working? Uh, Yeah, actually. I, I, I just got on duty, funny enough. Oh, that's crazy. You know, here I was thinking, hey, you know what? Maybe, maybe, just maybe I might see, you know... <laughs> The old, uh, the old, um, well, the old pal there flop. The old gangster? Nope. Yeah, I see, I see Lenny, I see Declan, I learn about anime, and, you know, I see, uh, Bayweather, and... I just got into flop, anime. I think I'm gonna join the anime club. It, 
Yeah. Is the is the is the A in thirteen alpha anime? N no, no, it's not. Hey, Captain, do you do you have a car? I do. Have okay, a car. why don't you just call uh, to check in and make sure you're alive? Fun. And I'm glad that you've trained yourself up to handle things. Cap, can I ride with you for a minute until I find a vehicle that isn't destroyed? Okay, thank you. Um. Absolutely. Good no, no, yeah, I, I, I just, I mean, listen, I, I just, I just got into to anime just recently. Uh, it's, it's, it's not bad. It's good. Oh, it's great, Flop. Is that the stuff with like the tentacles and shit? There is a, yeah. I mean, there, there, there's one. I, I'm watching a, a new series called Henty. Henty. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> but we should try free reign. Is like, is it like a chicken? Hint. Like, like a chicken, like having like a, like a little like drink shop, Henty? No, the, uh, the, the, the Henty's like, uh, I want you to run this scene, okay? You're gonna be scene lead. Anything you say goes. I don't know. It's like the, 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 the characters keep changing in the show. I don't know. It's weird. Oh. Oh, so it's like variety. Is like, is it like a variety Henty? I think so. Hey, I'm pulling up to a scene right now. Can I call you right back? Uh, you know, call me when you're available. Okay. All right. Will do. I, I, I appreciate it. Yeah, you take care. Watch out for whatever it is you're doing, okay? All right, hey, thank you. No matter what hard things come your way, I know you'll handle it. Listen, I'm always good with hard things. Don't you worry. I know. All right, bye-bye. All right, bye-bye. <laughs> Sorry, Cap. Good morning. Good morning, Flop. Hey, you're taking photos? How's your day, Ben? What's going on? All right, I should probably call 41. Well, yeah, you should. Dispatch 125-41. Once we get a little deeper, we'll go ahead and uh, take a pursuit order. Hey fam, welcome board flop. We are currently at the laundromat, just popped off. Copy that, I'll be 23 operating under 141. Late spin flag. Alright, easy. Captain, I'm gonna be honest, I don't know a lot about this anime stuff, but I'm 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 trying to learn. I'm 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 trying to get more like in the know. You know, I, I'm 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 trying to uh, to understand the the, the PD culture. Right? We have like a whole anime like, club and I don't know anything about them. Wait, we have an anime club? Well, I kind of, we, we have like Declan and Lenny and like... Oh uh, yeah, we have anime weebs in a PD. I'm trying to understand like, you know, the, the, the weeb logic, it's, it's hard. It's difficult. Yeah, I'm not sure honestly. Some, I just, I'm a, I'm a casual fan. I like to watch from time to time. I know a couple things, but I wouldn't call myself like a diehard fan. That's fair. I mean, I'm not really committed to that life. I, I enjoy it. I don't know if I am either. Last time I thought I was watching an anime, I said my favorite anime was Avatar Last Air Airbender, and I uh, I lost friends. Ooh, I love that cartoon. See, I, I thought it was an anime, and then I found out after that I was just wrong. <laughs> no, it's a cartoon. Fuck. I tried. <laughs> so are your sirens on? Which one? The uh, one you're next to? No? V-Star or the? Uh, yeah, the V-Star. It's probably just scuff. Got it. We'll uh, we'll drive and we'll come back. You still here, Brian? Ten. Copy. We'll drive away. Come back. Hey. <clears throat> Shift been busy today. Oh yeah. I mean, every day is a busy day, right? I mean, it's always like that, right? I mean, to to be fair, I, I I'd say uh, the level of aggression has definitely picked up. And I think the intensity of the calls have picked up, but I don't know if the actual workload is picked up. Right? It went from the uh, charger on scene. It went from senior bun stabbing four times a day to you know officers being held up with a knife, doctors being stabbed, EMS being held up at the hospital. It sort of like shifted into a lot more of uh, PPO. What's your name? Intense situations, Ventura. I guess. I don't know. Ventura. Move dispatch on duty. I'll check standby. Uh, one fifty five on ten seven. I, I am actively updating the card though. I could do it for you. Yeah, get us a channel for this uh, pursuit. At the All right. Use also two more seventy sevens. What's up, chat? What's up, Gold? How you doing? Great show though. Um, true story. For channel. I thought Avatar: Last Airbender was a. Pursuit. No, order can you hear the sirens? Slacks. Uh, Ventura is gonna take the hostage. Bay, you're gonna be secondary. Uh, I'll go ahead and be tertiary. Uh, once uh, Ventura is back in the pursuit, I'll move back into. Whenever, parallel. whenever we're on 1090 scenes, I, I, I want to see scene control where they cannot leave, right? Yeah. Like a lot of times, we Delphi have to control the flow of how things are. So just try to push a lot of the PD guys into getting the mindset. Okay, put down barriers, put down spikes. 
if they want those spikes gone, we can negotiate for that too as well, right? So no, definitely, there's no problem definitely. with that. But let's actually put done everything down so we can make sure that if they try to leave, they're not gonna leave right away. We can block them with our uh, barriers and our cars. No, definitely. I think so. What I've been doing since I, I want to say when I was uh, when I first got senior, I started telling people on scenes. I was like, hey, listen, you know. Sax, are you uh, oh, solo? No, I got flop. Hello. Okay. Oh, right. Channel three, by the way. Channel three. Yeah, channel three. Got it. You guys are gonna be primary. Okay. Yeah, I got that. Thank right, you. Right. Thank you. But I, I started telling people. I was just like, "Hey, listen, you're leading the scene. I want you to call when you, when you feel it's ready for PBS. If you have questions, let me know. I'm here. I'm trying to empower more people Check to three, one, one, for take the lead responsibility. I, night. Pursuit order. I think it's good to give people that chance to kind of let them Secondary fully lead a scene. Be the man in the gray suit. Absolutely. I mean, I was talking with uh, Knight mm -hmm. here, and obviously Archer led last scene, so I don't want to ask her to lead, scene, lead, you know, scenes back to back. So, no, definitely. On scene, you know what? Well, give him a crack at it. See what happens. Absolutely. Hey, listen, people make mistakes. We talk about a debrief after, but overall, as long as the flow of the scene goes okay, that's that's all I care about. <clears throat> all right. Is everyone back on channel three? Hey, firm. Hey, firm. All right, they're gonna be ready to go. Are we good to? Uh, yep. Uh, I'll grab your barrier. Go, baby. You got it. Sure, okay. Did you uh, get the comms as to what your position's gonna be? Yeah, from take hostage and then join the pursuit as tertiary. Easy. One four one's mobile and ready. Right, units are mounted. Secondary mounted. All right, we ready? Yeah, you you already know what's about to happen. I got, I got music ready. All right, they're gonna be getting the vehicle. Do we have any main targets or no? Yep, a hey, quit target drifting, is the individual in all black. Secondary tar target is that driver in the gray suit. Copy that, 141 primary. We are doubled, active 80, red in color, uh, electric vehicle, eastbound Carson Avenue. Traffic light weather is clear. Passing through the barrio, coming up to a rancho, left eastbound on Rancho Boulevard. Cross popular, continuing eastbound on Rancho. Speeds are about 150. Continuing eastbound on Rancho, crossing over Elysian Fields. Continuing North Battle Rancho, coming up on Fudge Lane. Now crossed, speeds are slowing down. Cross Capital, continuing North Battle on El Rancho. Making our way toward Mayor Park. <clears throat> continuing North Battle Rancho, transitioning now northbound Mayor Park Boulevard. Continue to about Mirror Park Boulevard. Pass by the gas station. <clears throat> Cross Glory Way, continuing west. Making our way toward the vault. Oop, they almost flipped. We almost flipped. We're good. Uh, continuing yeah, westbound, we'll Vinyl Boulevard. I saw them go, and then, I, and then we went. Coming up on the vault now. Now pass, continuing westbound, Vinyl Boulevard. Speeds are about 100 miles an hour. Heavy traffic up ahead, be careful. Vehicles opposing lanes. Now correct lanes, westbound at Close Boulevard. <clears throat> Passing Tequila Lock, continuing westbound at Clips. Whoop, uh, stand by, continuing westbound west of Clips. Opposing lanes of travel. Speed's still about 100 miles an hour. <clears throat> Continuing westbound, West Eclipse, gonna be approaching Dorset. Stand by. Cross Dorset, transitioning southbound, Cougar Avenue, left south, Morningwood Boulevard. Pursuit has been reckless so far, by the way. Unfortunately, travel struck multiple vehicles. Left eastbound, Mar uh, 22 Marathon Avenue, excuse me. <laughs> Still waking up. Continuing eastbound, Marathon Avenue, right southbound, moves their way. 
Approach San Andreas. Left eastbound San Andreas Ev. Continuing eastbound San Andreas Avenue. Past Senior Buns. Los Santos Police Department, stop that vehicle. Do now. Staying lower San Andreas. Still east. Crossing under uh, the ramp that leads to upper. Approaching Legion Square. Heavy brake. Watch out for the tow truck. Right tow southbound. Truck, you. Thank you. Uh, Elgin Ave. Right westbound. Vespucci Boulevard. We are sort of circling the area. We're now standby. Right northbound going upper. Northbound power, upper power. <clears throat> Cross Swiss, continuing north power. Slowing left westbound occupation. Left southbound Alta. Swap coming through. Swap on Del Perro. Swap on Del Perro. Uh, back Let's left. Copy of white and color sedan of some sort. We're going to stick on primary vehicle. Southbound Alta. We're on the sedan. Continue eastbound. What, was that guy the primary suspect? One of them. Okay. We could use a 77 hour pursuit stop on Alta. We still got that. Box it up. Uh, we have that white and color vehicle box on integrity. And Run and color. Come, come back now. It might come back to y'all. Get ready for it. Yeah, me. Every unit broke off this chase for that guy. Okay, and we have foot bail. Yeah, uh, one should stay with us. One night three, two, two, two stay back. Vehicle. It's all good. I have relief on night. We'll try and maintain. Did they say that they were in a foot bail? I believe so. We got one night. Go to work. We still got the vehicle eastbound Rancho. This is 77 from channel one, if possible. Do you guys have any outstanding foot bales? Radio check. Are there any outstanding foot bales? Um, we have one individual still in the vehicle. Um, Copy. We can hold comms for now. Go ahead and uh, take them. I got lethal just in case. Okay. Gotta get uh, 77 on channel one if possible too. Right. Y'all doing on the pursuit of the red vehicle? Still on it, southbound uh, Palomino Freeway, taking the ramp toward Elysian Field. Stand by, we're at the fork. Hey firm, I asked for backup, no response yet. Stop you. Hey firm. Brian, I'm gonna move uh, the, away just a little bit so you can get to the driver's door if you can have your uh, baton ready to pull him out. Hey firm. Oh God. Uh, Three, two. I wonder what their plan is. They're just I don't know. Ryan. They're just Joe Adam right now. They might be coming back actually. The advised red vehicle is close to you guys. They may be coming to your scene right now. Uh, they're you turning actually 22. Please give it up. If the red vehicle approaches, do you want me to try to spike it? It's a nice call night. You call it. So, Captain, I got some bad okay. news. Nate's trying to currently <laughs> pull a swap here. Get ready for it. Yep. Yep. Call it, call it, call it. Diggle might be trying to go for a swap right now on uh, What's Del Perro East. You got diarrhea? No, 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 no. Uh, I really love looking through this windshield. Might be a swap uh, on Hey, do not get Del out. Perro. Do not get out. She got out. She got out. Do not get out. No. She got out, Flax. No. Police, give it up. I, chat, I can't get out of. One female was dropped out that was wearing the gray vest, the blonde hair. She's on foot on the phone uh, on the train tracks, frail to a popular street. Red vehicle still got two suspects <laughs> inside of us, though. Copy, our individual is foot bailing southbound towards the G6. Hi, Bay. Um, I'd say stay with mobile and then come back. If he starts coming back to the car, you come close the box again. Go away, slacks. 195. Okay. I'm yield and surrender, okay? Right, uh, what's your you 20 love, on the you uh, I, I, I love looking through this uh, windshield. It's very hard to see around me right now. Uh, I'm gonna... Oh my god! Yeah. You're right. It... Holy shit. It is terrible. Right, watch battle, actual boulevard. Let me know if you can take comms. Uh, hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna try. Hold on. Okay. <laughs> Try best. 
Should we collate these guys to kind of the uh, G6 spot? Uh, you call a night. We still got the pursuit westbound Carson right now. Fast. We're gonna have <laughs> I don't know what to do. <laughs> you have another unit coming your way. That's make it two, right? Now merging southbound on the train tracks parallel to Lewis Boulevard. Pushing Dutch London, left eastbound Dutch London. Gonna smoke me on these turns because they're so much faster. Yeah, I can take comms if they're in front, but if I lose it, I'm gonna need you to take over because I can only see out the, <laughs> the windshield. I got it, I got it. Okay. Still pushing westbound of Carson, you turning now, slowing down right northbound, Jamestown. Pushing north of the barrio. Right eastbound. This is kind of intense. Slowing down, they're taking the jump to a little more avenue right now. Ah, <sighs> uh, 1050. Might be out of it. Northbound, Liberty Avenue. I'm going to pass you to Channel 3, where's 77? Uh, Northbound, Liberty Avenue, running color ready on our uh, Tesla. Captain, you okay? Yeah, flop! I'm, right, I'm right. upside down! You're going to be okay! Listen, the blood's going to rush your head. You may pass the fuck out, but it doesn't mean that you're going to die, okay? Northbound? Yeah, yeah, we're northbound. All right, we're passing northbound Little Bighorn Avenue. It's going to be a red and colored Jesus. Raiden occupied, I believe, two times. <gasps> oh, fuck. Oh, oh my Holy God. Shit. Good I put work, good work. Oh, my God. I might go back to the scene that would have 95, so it's just uh, fall back there. Hey, Perm, do you want us to uh, load these guys up or just that what? Uh, whenever you're ready, now you call it. You're the scene lead. Hey, Perm, I'm going to give it a second. Let me know if they come this way. If they don't, in the next few minutes, we're going to load them up. That was risk, unlucky. Uh, I didn't expect our car to look uh, like that. You know, they're friends. Is, this is kind of a heavy car, to be fair. Yeah, I should have realized that. You're right. I should have went around knowing that my car might flip. It's all good. Know the, strength and weaknesses so you can apply them in the pursuit. I will say McNulty does oh, talk pretty highly about power this power vehicle. Every time I drive it, I hate it. West. If they're highway blasting, it's really good. But if, if yeah. uh, it, it's a good car for, um, you know, speeds in a straight line. It has when you start purpose. turning. Yeah. And then the jumps, it's 50-50. Oh, they're underneath us. Okay, thought they're here. It's all good. Uh, it actually might be good to be up here to look over the freeway, maybe. Right, gonna, I don't know. Uh, it's up to you. Sure, sure, sure. I like in, that. Um, the two on power. But for when we above y'all uh. on Swiss and how power give you a high ground. Hey, firm. What do you think the over under of the red car coming back? Uh, actually, is that it right there? Nope. Wait, is that it? Uh, Ventura, does your guy need medical? It's negative. Where? Good advice. I saw a red and color vehicle westbound Del Perro. It looks like it slowed down. I don't know if it was the same vehicle, though. Just keep an eye on Del Perro. Sure. We're about to get these guys over if you want to chase it. I'll leave it up to you. We're, we have high ground. By the time we get there, we're, we're already going to be BCB. Hey, firm. 9576 Mission Road PD1. Sorry, it, it, it was so brief. I just I saw a red car and I couldn't tell if it was the same one. No, you're fine. Could have been them slow rolling the scene, seeing if their boats got caught or not, right? That's a possibility. Probably. All right. I'm going to go back and drop off a V-Star. Nice. Good shit. Yeah, there's no vehicles out right now that aren't damaged at the moment. I'm going to take note of the activity logs for them and hopefully... Ooh. I didn't clock them. 1060. Ooh. I'm going to transition channel one. Yep. One, four, We're going back channel one. We got a traffic stop southbound. Elgin. One, four, one radio check. Engine off. Dispatch oh, one, four, one, down. 1038 northbound. Right. Correction southbound. Elgin Ave. Black and color. Hey, uh, sports car LSPD. sedan. Front of ammunition. Me, Eagle flag 1060. Requesting four, a 77. All right. Reason to stop is because obviously you're speeding. Also failed to stop at a red light. You know, stop and go. And then... This vehicle, his report is stolen. No. Mm -hmm. So, when I ask for your cooperation, you come out here. You, say we're you know, you work with me, I can Copy. work with you. 
Uh, right, you know, you take off, there could be more charges. If not, you could be just looking at misdemeanor charges for today. That's all it is. You know, Joe riding and the ticket. I'll take the car from you. I mean, you can have the car, I don't care. Oh, perfect. Thank you. Is there anything else on you? No. Is there anything uh, in the vehicle I should know of before I start searching it? No, it should be clean. There should be nothing in it. Okay, all right. Be going through your pockets and poke your problem. You stand, know about a wrench. Let's see. Where did you get the car from? Dude, Slack ain't playing. He's just like, yo, dude, uh, your shit's fucking broken into. You stole this shit. Give me the car. Right. 111, I'm 1012 for that 38. Hey, firm, be advised. Uh, driver is out and is willingly giving it up. We should be Ocean King. Oh, copy. Surprised. I'm gonna be honest. I'm super surprised. <laughs> it's going fantastic. How's your day going? All right. What's up, dudes? Okay. So for today, you are gonna get failure to obey a traffic control device and jaw riding. It's gonna be um, citations, misdemeanors. So I'm gonna give you um, a fine, and you're gonna be cut on time served. You're all good to go. If you could just do me a solid and just um, get out of here as we process the vehicle. I'd appreciate that. Okay. Have a good day, Slack. You as well. Dispatch 125 requesting an impound and a black and color uh, sedan flag 1060 block. South Elgin. Just add it to it. Copy. Uh, what was that? Sorry. There's a report up if you want. Report number 447. Okay. I got photos already. All good to go. Pick has been called in. Uh, I'll throw up the photos real quick. I appreciate that. Thank you. Hey, motor. Thank you for the backup. One for one. Traffic stop clear. 76 going to show up, Biddy. Uh, uh, uh. All right. Any yeah, senior officer able to respond to that latest uh, three one? Uh, what was the three one one? Moose Knuckles. A flop will deal with it. Okay, I know what this is about. My issue with it is this is involving an officer out of my shift, and I don't know the best. I told him I would try and get in touch with somebody for him. I don't know who to reach out to for it. Oh, talk to Archer. She's shift two, right? Is he for shift two? I believe so, yeah. Let me call Archer and see if uh, she can help me with this. All right, perfect. Appreciate it, Cap. Of course. Let me take my car to Mosley's and see if I can replace my engine. Yeah, we'll do. All right. What quarter numbers did you hit last week? Uh, I mean, there's a thing here. We apparently achieved it. Uh, let's go talk to Moose Knuckles real quick. I don't... I don't know. Yo, Varu, what's going on? Thank you so much for the 13 months. I appreciate it. Can we get some hearts in chat, please? Thank you. Thank you. Hope you're doing amazing. Hope you're doing well today. What's good? Mm. I'm suddenly on trial. Who's this? Beautiful yak bag. Hey. The flop. Hey. Almost rusty. Um, Cops here. Hey, what? My, my, my new friends who I'm definitely not afraid of because they're babunkas um, um, want to lodge a complaint about um, being pocket wiped by um, you guys. Okay. 
Uh, who were you guys arrested by? Who was processing? Give me the lowdown. I forget his name. Blonde. I have number. Wait, what happened? I have number for report. Oh, is the incident number? Yeah, that 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 works. Why use many words when few words work best? Yeah, it'd be 4377 is the incident. You said he was blonde? He were. Mm. Blonde. What color outfit was he wearing? Blue. Did he have stripes on his arm? Mm-hmm. I see ID? Cartel. He doesn't have you one what? because it how took all I of give his you, shit. How could I give you what name? anything? Kowalski, Mark. I flop, senior. <laughs> yes. Met before. Punched you in face. I read report. Deal. <laughs> we have entered into negotiations. <laughs> this is this is you, ever play, you ever play Pokemon Stadium back in the day? Yes. It's oh kind of like God. you guys are turn based right now. We kind of are. Well, who's the Pokemon master on each side? Wait, hold I on. Know. I was on this call. When the fuck did this happen? Yes, you Declan come. <laughs> you Declan come right before I get shot. Oh, oh they came. Huh. Was this was yeah, was came. this off of Bay City Avenue? Yes. By the old. Okay, hold on. Yes, in apartment. By I used to trip Blucky and Cop. Cuss him out. Go to stab Gary. Gary Hyde. I wait for Gary. Friend take Gary hostage. Gary a little bitch. Cop lock stop. Gary run. Try to stab. Miss. Go for cop. Many shot. Me. Go to prison. Get out prison. Allegedly. Go to MR. Well, not guilty. Go to prison. Come out prison. Try to get things. No things. Go to MRPD. No things. Go to, go to prison. No things. Go to okay. MRPD. No things. You guys is stole. Okay. From me. Okay. 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 My livelihood. I would love to simplify terms on this. Oh God! Another cop gonna tell me to call a, a fucking exterminator. Uh, Y'all stole from me. I'm gonna check. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go check the the locker and see what's in the locker. And I'm gonna come back out and see. Does that sound good? Reparations. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah, that's, that's, yeah, we'll be here. This is gonna be a bug report. I, I'm just gonna. I'm gonna just say it. Yeah, he gonna find out. I feel bad, but he gonna find out. <laughs> Dog, he <laughs> he ain't had anything stolen. One three six seventy six slave one. You can educate him. I have a question. Answer eight inches. Yeah. I'm eleven inches. Thank you, dog. Uh, okay. So when the the, the stuff you have missing, three, six, is it literally everything, or do you have certain things? No, it is literally everything. It is like everything. No ID, no phone, no key, nothing. I really hate this. I really fucking hate this. Okay, so... I, I don't want to tell you what you don't want to hear, but I'm going to just give you the blunt truth because I'm not here to bullshit. I'm a, I'm, I speak from heart to... Hold on. To, to, to you. I, we... But I wish don't have shit. We, could be we have your knife, or cousins. but that's it. So, yeah. Can I have my knife back so I can stab you? I no, no, we we not we no, don't we're not. Helping. No, he's he, helping. I help. He's he's help. Good. I help. He good. I help. <laughs> you you stab later, but now I help. Yeah. Wow, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, wow, yeah. I know. I know. Next time, next time. Is there, a, is there a fund so he can at least get his house key? How much is the the house key? Oh, almost 4,000. Yeah. 30 something plus tax. Mm. 
No, but I'll do this for you. I will oh, personally wow. give you. I I I I, I could give you about three grand. Yeah. But anyways, next time. Oh. Ho hopefully to help you at least replace the house key, but that's about the best I could do. That's coming out of my pocket. Thank you. Thank you. Anything helps. Okay. Uh. I'm sorry. Uh, specifically, I'm just helping replace the house key because if there's anything that you're missing, the house key is probably the hard one to replace. Yeah. 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 Let me stay here. One sec. As you know, crime oh. doesn't pay. Wait, did they get rid of the. Argue. I just realized there's no fucking ATM across the street anymore, isn't there? Oh, I don't know. Blue Cycles, do you know where the closest ATM is? Uh, not really. I would probably just go to Legion Square Bank. Require luck. Okay. I'll be right back. Hold on. 136 DL. I want senior buns. 10 8. I do feel bad for him. Um. Sounds like the beginning of a joke. Maybe. I'm going to help him replace his house key. Honestly, out of all the fuck shit to lose, it sucks that Scuff gets rid of the house key. Um. Slacks is going to hate me, but guess what, bud? Eh. Oh, it's a fucking sequential. God damn it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give him a little bit of money. I feel bad, and I'm not a fucker. Actually, that's a lie. I am a fucker. I'm just, I'm not a mean fucker. Take him down to try and retrieve his items. If they, if they don't come back from prison, uh, and he can't find them in the lobby, the one downstairs won't, won't make a difference, unfortunately. Dude, I'm gonna have fucking sticky keys with how quick you gotta shift this fucking car. Holy crap. Yeah, the item retrieval thing is probably the worst scuff that we deal with right now. I hate seizing possessions because there's always that guarantee that like they may lose their shit. You know what I mean? Bro, why is there so much trash in this fucking PD? All right. This is straight out of my bank to you, but hopefully at the minimum, this gets you back your house key. Um, I'm sorry. I am going to say to obviously, you know, reach out to government officials about that because that's a, that's a shitty one. You heard him. You got to reach around the officials. Yeah, mm -hmm. you got to yeah, reach around I've the ref. Given, How much is the, the reach around cost? Reach around. It's free. Well, apparently it's, it's $3,000. Well, it costs nice. it cost him look, it, a lot more than that, to be honest. Oh, so, uh, Flop, you, you need some alone time with him or? Uh, no, uh, you no. own him for a little Finish while now. Do I? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's how. I mean, you just paid $3,000 for money. him, so. Yeah. So he's like mine right now? Man. Imagine what you could do with oh. this cavernous hole. Or um, oh what's the god. definition of human trafficking again? Uh, yes. Not this. Not this. This is art. Oh my god. Oh Jesus. Do you see this? Oh god. Oh. Look. Oh my god. Jesus. I uh, keep it warm and moist. I'm sorry. One, one, one sec. I need to go grab my cigarettes. Andy I left my milk out. I gotta go put it back in the fridge. Heading off road onto Del Perro <laughs> Freeway. Hey, how do we said hello? Yeah. What happened in the route? He's bound up Paro Freeway. You, um, I still have. Remember that complaint I called you about? Yeah. I'm going to popular right I'm, now. I'm sure. 
111. I'm going to write this down again for the name of the officer. I'm going to reach out specifically to I, that I ship. Have, we never actually talked about it formally. And it, there's I not, had a client reach out to me with um, uh, an anonymous complaint they'd like to put forward. Um, okay. Uh, you'll understand why if I tell you it. Do you have any weapons on you? Nah, yucka mimes take all that off me when they beat me. All right, come here. Look out, excuse, up to you. Come on. Thank you. Come on, Moose Knuckles. See you guys later. Oh, uh, oh, Moose Knuckles. That's a weird door. I don't know Moose, move. Right okay, okay, I'm coming. Oh, I made it. All right, I need it. I need a name of the first officer uh, that you were dealing with again. Because I tried reaching out, I'm just drawing a blank on the name. I, I I would I would Officer Opal Price, and between you and me, Flop, you know, when we negotiate, we negotiate I... in good faith with you guys. And when you guys, when people change their mind, uh, I don't know, I, after I... talking to us, it's really disappointing. I know, I know. I, I don't I don't doubt that for a second. I'm not gonna lie. I've heard about a, situ a similar situation only one other time ever but the fact that it's happened once is already too many so i don't doubt it i'm gonna make yeah. sure i reach out to the proper shift for that the anonymous complaint do you know which officer that is and do you we'll we'll, we'll, we'll go in the, the 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 briefing room all right okay what do you got um um okay the person reached out to me. Uh, apparently, they were part. So they wanted to come down here themselves, but I will caution them that that's probably a dumbass idea. <laughs> uh, they were part of a group that was apparently robbery, robbing a laundromat the other day. Um, and uh, four of them were robbing it. Uh, they took off in vehicle uh, and were pursued. And when they tried to uh, there was no uh, weapons brought out on fire officers or, you know, nothing like that. Um, no officers were in imminent threat at that point. But when uh, my client tried to swap onto a um, motorbike, um, I guess Officer Ruby was there. Um, oh. And they're pretty sure it was oh. Officer Frost, but not, not the nice one with the black and gray hair. A lady, but um, I guess there's a male Frost. He, he wasn't certain of the name, but he said brown hair. And Ruby was with him. But I, I guess they hopped out of the vehicle and he went to tase my client. And just as my client got on the motorbike, he fired. <clears throat> but he pulled out his gun and put a couple in his back and before he realized it. Um, I told him he got away. I mean... He survived. He got away. He really wanted to come down here and tell you guys all about it. But I feel like that probably would have been a dumbass idea. Uh-oh. And he should just take his... And he was like, well, we should sue. I don't think that's the right idea either, dumbass. Maybe just take your winnings and yuck off. But he asked me to just formally put it on the record that, um, you know... Shooting someone in the back when they're not armed and so, no imminent threat. I think the officer thought he had a taser in his hands. Uh, I'm going to... Oh, man. Okay. And I mean, it happens. Well... We know it happens, but it's unfortunate. I, I'm, I'm trying to think of a good way to say this. This is just going to... Moose Knuckles, I, I want you to know I'm not deflecting this at all. You know I'm not that kind of guy, and I, I'm, I'm going to give things to you straight. 100%. There are times in recent time I have heard of officers literally holding their taser, going to shoot a taser cartridge, and for some reason, the taser cartridges are sometimes just, for whatever reason, chambered in 9 mil. If Ruby was on scene and 
there was an actual intent to kill, I'm sure Ruby would have been the one to take care of it. Oh, 100%. Ruby seems like a very nice cop. No, she she's she's amazing. She's she's a great assistant chief. Um ass chief. <laughs> yeah, she 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 is the ass chief. She's my favorite ass chief. Out of every ass chief <laughs> we have in the PD right now, she's by far my favorite. If you can imagine that. Um I will follow Basically, I'm going to follow up I with Ruby on it. You don't need to do too much. I just need to do right by my client and bring it up. But I understand exactly what you're telling me. And I know I've heard of it happening before. And quite frankly, the, the yuck bags got away. So it's it's not like they were, yeah, he was hurty and we all get hurty, but he survived and uh, he robbed, he did some bad things and felt good about himself for a few hours. Well, put that in your therapy bucket and live life, right? Sure. Yeah. I just need to make sure I bring it up at least just so I did my diligence and you know, I'm not too worried about it beyond that. You're fine. For for now, uh, I mean, re respectfully, two-way street here. If he wants to stay anonymous, I'll stay anonymous. Just say you spoke to a superior officer. He's going to follow up and check up. But as far as he knows, it is more likely than not. I would even go on a limb and say it was. it's probably beyond likely that the situation was probably what I just explained. 100%. I like that. That's a good way to put things. Yep. If you can do that for me, I will, uh, I'll do my best to follow up and go from there and try and, and touch up. 10-4, I'm on board. The Opal situation, I will talk to an officer within their shift to hopefully have them take it because I'm going to be honest, I would not be able to do any part of that investigation internally as I have met Opal maybe once. Fair. Uh, you should, if you're bored one night, you should look at the docket for Ember's murder. It, Moose Knuckles was, <clears throat> man, a flop. I lost my yuck and mind on Oliver Hall and Opal. Uh, Damien had a negotiated plea that was raised. It was way more than I had agreed to originally, but uh, it was fine. At least we could get her out tomorrow. Uh, so I asked them to go up to the prison. Let's get it done. And they changed it again from five days to 35 yucking days in prison and refused to talk anything else. I lost my mind on them. I threw them out of there. I said, get your yucking ugly ass out of my sight. <clears throat> I can't talk to people who don't want to be somewhat reasonable. It's like when you talk to those community guys and all they want to do is yell about how they're innocent when you, you got them on camera. Like, at some point, we got to just accept that you've done something dumb. I don't disagree. Uh, like I said, I don't, I don't like the idea of this happening. I will bring it up in general. And because I, I, I'm, uh, how do I say this? I'm going to tell you how this is going to go. Uh, and this is just the reality. Opal is probably not going to see anything internal come from this in terms of punishment because technically didn't do anything wrong. Technically. The reality, yeah. though, is the damage that this causes is far beyond an internal punishment. And I think to nip that in the butt and let people know that, you know, we go off the agreement of pleas for a reason when we deal with attorneys and we need to honor those in order to keep a trust between the two because we have to work with each other. I think that's the real message that needs to be sent. I will do my best to let someone talk to Opal at least and get get their, you know, their side. Um, I don't need any hand slapped or nothing um, that's not what i'm asking for really you're, it's you're, just, you're asking like for she cried to me on the phone and told me that she can't make a decision so she's got to talk to a senior officer and she'll call me back in a half hour or so and then she went off duty and went home uh, i know that because i talked to slacks an hour later and he said she was gone mm. and that was when in principle she said what we what i was offering for a plea bargain made sense but she wanted to run it by a senior officer so it's not so much that she needs a 
a slap on the hand or whatever you guys do for punishments. Just more as a cadet, because that's why she said she was crying. Uh, she was she didn't know what she was allowed to do. So may, maybe it's a learning opportunity for the training, or a, just a an opportunity to, for a senior officer to sit with her and help her understand what she's permitted to do during a plea negotiation. Because it I mean the the reality didn't feel like she knew the the reality is that a lot of, we we don't how do I say this. The communication between lawyers is not something that we train. That's something that comes with time. And I think a lot of the newer officers go sure off sucks of... sucks that she got a first-degree murder as a Yeah, kidnapped. yeah. I'll bring it up. I'll see what I can do. I'll All get right. back to you and go from there. I sincerely appreciate you, Flop. I got you, absolutely. Even though we, we had our rough times back in the old days. Every once in a while, but it's okay. You know what? Listen, the, the reality is we, we are on a new path on a new wavelength. Yeah, as long as Moose Knuckle doesn't lose his bar license because he gets angry again. No, no, you, you're not going to lose your bar license. Listen, the, the reality is that you are for the people. And I would stand in front of a judge and, and tell anyone that you straight up haven't. <laughs> you're, you're one of the most active lawyers we have right now. If they got rid of yeah. you, they'd be doing a disservice to the DOJ. I haven't gotten a single docket po uh, posting accepted by anybody, which is feeling like I'm doing something really stupid. I don't know what's going on. You're not. You're not. The DOJ, work, the DOJ works at a certain pace, and sometimes your timing isn't right, and that goes for anybody, and I wouldn't, I wouldn't shoot yourself in the foot with that. Uh, I just mean they reject them all, and nobody talks to me. I don't know what's going on. I would reach out and, and, and just ask them, but I don't think you're doing anything wrong. I think I'm you're trying. I, I will tell you from experience, you are a, a good cell rep. And I, I don't say that about a lot of people. I think a lot of the cell reps sometimes drive me insane. You are a good cell rep. Well, thanks, Flop. Gotcha. I that from you. you. I respect you quite a lot. I appreciate that. Um, I can let you out the side door real quick if you want. This way I can make a phone call, see, see what okay. I can do about this. Sure, I didn't know there was a side door. No, you're good. You're about to learn today. Oh, man. Is the fire alarm going to go off? No, 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 no. It says fire exit, oh. but... Check <laughs> that out. Isn't that good? Nice. All, All right. right. Thank you very much, Floppy. I got you, you stay Moose. Stay safe and watch out for birds. I'm going to do my best. Listen, these birds are fucking crazy. I had one fly down real low the other day, and I almost ran it over on purpose. It was terrifying. Exactly. They're yucking dinosaurs. You got to be careful. They're not even dinosaurs. They're they're rant. Listen, I'm telling you. You want to know how Max knows everything? Birds. What? Maybe they're working in cahoots because they do poop. Birds. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. something chill there we go uh all right yeah so the taser thing i'm, I'm gonna be honest probably scuff 